Hi, beautiful people, the Most High God. So, um, you know, if you people have been watching my channel for the last couple months, God has been making me talk about judgment, right? Um, as you can see, like, at one point, it was just like different judgments, 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 right? Um, like, if we go right here, curses and judgments are sent out right on thieves robbers defrauders the bloody city babylon reward of double full judgments seven full judgments he for the last couple months hundred full judgments god has been like revealing judgments and day of vengeance recompense and that as you know that since a viv that we're in the year of recompense um judgments and revelations have been going out a lot judgments 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 um we're in the year of recompense which i've told you people that in many videos and i just i did so this is a video from three months ago but god gave us a revelation on my channel revelation how god chooses a king and a queen and he did not choose the queen who died today and remember what god told me to tell you so i'm going to go to the video to see that prophecies the revelation of god in which what he said came to pass okay people of god now she's just like the wicked now, what did God tell me? With his lineage and his chosen people. Did this not happen? I'm going to go back. Listen right? to what I say. And um, among other things, but let's let's get into it. So he wants you to know why he chooses a king and a queen. Um, and a man's enemies are they of his own household. When God chooses a king and he chooses a queen, it's not because of their outside appearance. And it's because of their heart. And he wants to ask you a question. What makes you think he chose Queen Elizabeth to be his queen? And what makes you think that she, she is his chosen people? And that she comes out of the house of David? And to fast and pray to him to know about that. Because she has nothing to do with his lineage. And his chosen people. And his chosen generation and nation. She's not a part of his people. And she's judged. And um, why? And, and he also wants to ask you a question. What has she taught you? Because all of those who he chooses teaches his people righteousness. What has she taught you? She's just like the wicked imposters who fought and were cutthroat for the throne. Now, let's get into it. Why God chooses a king and why God chooses a queen. And... Um, Let's get into it. So he wants me to talk about King David, King Solomon, and um, even daughter Zion, why he chose her. It all goes that and that he would never choose Queen Elizabeth to be his queen and that she stole the throne and she oppressed his people and he's judging her and her days are numbered. Now, um, I walked and I talked. So... What did God tell you? He, She was on borrowed time and he's judging her. That was how many months ago? That was three months ago he had me make this video. How he chooses a king and a queen. He did not choose her. Alright, so you have to understand we're in a time of judgment. We're in a time of recompense. And a lot of people have not come to terms with that they think they have a lot of time left um yeah seven months ago i've i think was maybe the first time i've told you about the year of recompense and to fast so in these seven months if you've been taking heed to the revelations god has been revealing on this channel then you, you you just seen one come to pass well other people you've if you've been watching this long my channel long enough you've seen more than one come to pass and people really need to repent at this time 
And this is not to speak bad on anyone because death is not good for anyone, right? God doesn't desire that the wicked should die, but everybody should come to repentance. This is to open up your eyes to repent because what did he say he's judging? He's judging bribery. He's judging wickedness. You reap what you sow. These are things he's been revealing on my channel. So you adjust weight and adjust balance. When he tells me to do something, I just do it because I'm not being disobedient. It's to help his servants and even it's to help myself. So please, people of God, understand the time that you are in. That these are the last days. We are living out the book of Revelation. Sometimes he says Re Revelation to reveal a word to you. That's why it'll say Revelation before that. Like this, Revelation. King David, Mufasa is King David. And Simba is actually Zion. These, This is Revelations. Okay? And then he has times where he says judgments. And then he has times where he's teaching us. Like, I don't know what God's going to say next or what I'm going to speak about. But when he lets me know to make a, make a video, this is the scriptures, this is what, I just do it. Hypocrites being judged. That was three months ago. So you have to understand he's judging all these things. Not the way... The, as he says it, it, you know, God's word doesn't return to him void. I'm just bringing this to your attention so you people repent. Repent, repent, repent. And don't stop saying, maybe I'm going to do it next week. Maybe I'm going to do it next year. Maybe I'm going to do it next month. Um, You should do that now. You should be, repentance is daily. Repentance is every single day, people of God. And I love you. And please repent and please put on your discernment. And if you don't have it, wisdom, ask God for it. And if you don't understand something, ask God for the understanding. Stay blessed. Please repent. Stay prayed up and pray for your, pray for everyone that you come into contact with. Pray for everyone you know. Pray for God's creation. Pray for forgiveness show mercy and ask for forgiveness and forgive others because you know if you don't forgive others god won't forgive you i love you all and i pl and this was not to speak down on the de on death because god does not delight in death god wants us to turn away from our wickedness so we can live this was just to Reveal to you that what God said surely came to pass and that his word doesn't return void. Stay blessed.